first, you know, just or Matt, I'm sorry. Uh, just first, it never gets old. But just talk about the pressure of you know what? If I play at John Curtis and I don't win a state championship, the season's considered disappointing. How do you deal with that? Well, I mean, um, we don't go into the game thinking if um, we we don't win. What will happen? We go into the game thinking that we prepared the best we can, and hopefully that will get us over the top of the state championship. And ultimately, it did. I wouldn't want to um, have won it with anybody um, else. It was a great group of guys who worked hard, and we deserved it. And I mean, um, we went out and executed. We didn't make every play we, we might have wanted to, but um, I feel it was a great effort on the line and offense and defense, secondary, receivers, running backs, all around special teams. All right, now that now that the junior season is you know over, how much concentration do you give to recruiting right now? Um. I mean, not as over, I'll give a little bit more, you know, but I'm saying I'm going into basketball, I'm going to take that serious because if I'm, if I'm going to involve myself in something, I'm going to put my full effort into it. But um, now that football's over, I'm going to give some effort into my recruiting. But, I mean, I'm, I'm not really worried about that. I have a while to make my decision. What does that entail, the effort? Is it just more listening to coaches, maybe making some visits? What does that um, entail? I mean, probably uh, talking to a few more colleges than I have. While the season was going on, I wanted to stay focused on what was our goal was to win the day, and we got that completed. And now um, I'll talk, be able to talk to coaches and see what's going on. All right, give me some schools. Like where? I mean, is it a rough list you're trying to start to put together in your um, head? I mean, it's not rough. It's just, <laughs> I mean... It's a lot, so I mean, I'm just trying to give everybody a fair chance and see what they have to say, and um, just, just see what, what, what's best for me. In terms of LSU, talk about the relationship. What's the assistant coach that's recruiting you? Um, all of them. All of them. Okay. Just talk about the relationship with LSU. Do you like what you're hearing, or is um, it still just like I'm I'm starting this now kind of thing? No, I mean, I talk to the coaches all the time. I talk to most of the schools that that are recruiting me all the time. I have a good relationship with our coach from LSU. I mean, um, uh. It's just, it's just a good relationship, and I mean, um, it's just, I mean, I just take it slow. Is it one of those things, you know, when you talk to the in-state players, some in-state players are like, you know what, sometimes I just want to leave, right, just right. to see what the rest of the country looks like. Is that something you want to do, or is it, I don't have a problem staying at home? I don't have a problem with it, because I'm, I'm going to just see what fits me um, best on and off the field, and see what will be best for me and my family. Um, I'm not just going to just limit myself and be... Um, narrow-minded, um, I'm going to see what's best for me, and if ultimately it is to go far away or if it is to stay home, um, I hope it will be the uh, right decision for me.